Welcome to First at Four. I'm Monica Hannon, and look who's with me. It's Jacob Noterman for the first time, so we welcome him to First at Four. This is not your first rodeo, so let's yeah. let's take a look at, at your... Uh... Stay safe, and we'll see you next time. What was that? What was that? <laughs> I'm desperately sorry to all the people of North Dakota for that. What What is it? What is it, like a nervous thing? Or? I don't think it's a nervous thing, because then I'd be winking all the time. I think it's just, uh, I just wink as my way of acknowledging that something has been done, but I don't know how to advance the conversation afterwards. Oh, so you just wink. So I just wink, yeah. All right, so uh, Henry, time for the, <laughs> time for the weather. <laughs> Have you ever gone to a drive-in movie? Uh, no, I've been single for a while. <laughs> okay. there's, a, there's the laughter I was looking for. <laughs> you know, you can go to them without being on a date. Yeah, but then you're just in a driving movie alone, and I think that just comes across as worse, if I'm being honest. Poor Jacob. <laughs> he needs friends. The doldrums of this unprecedented global lockdown. Drive-in theaters, I've heard, are a hoot and a half, but I can't say that I've ever been to one. Here in North Dakota, you know, you, you have to roll the windows up or the mosquitoes get you. And if it's in the winter, you got to roll the windows up or the cold will get you. I mean, no disrespect by this, but uh, when you said roll up and roll down your windows, you actually rolled them. It's because I was... I know. Uh, yeah, yeah. Not that long ago, Cliff had a truck where he was rolling the windows. It's not that... It's... it's there are people that have those. I, there are people, sure. We've just changed the technology in the last 20 years. Coming up <laughs> on First at Four. This is going to be a fun time. Here, you could also do the drive through food bank or give blood. Well... You could do all three things on the same day. That's a, that's a productive day. That's more productive than what I'm doing today right now. I'm yeah. not saving any lives right now. Well, you might be. You don't know. Yeah, let's Florida. go. You're welcome, North Dakota. <laughs> I don't even have anyone I've ever met who would even be up for the uh, that proposal on the jumbotron. Yeah. No. 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 Girls don't like that kind of thing. I don't think. I'm gonna write that down. Yeah. Write no. That don't down. do that. Don't, don't do, do that. That's that. not romantic. Romantic is you know someplace. Well, it doesn't really matter where. It's just as long as it's it's lovely and it's you. But you know everybody has somebody taking their picture now, so it's it's hardly ever private anymore it seems like but I just want to say earlier I noticed Jacob kind of jotting down some notes so if it, <laughs> when you get married or take, take advice, see he's taking your advice right now so <laughs> but if it goes down goes downhill well I don't know but I, I've known you give some good advice to Jacob I think you're good yeah well I, I the girls out there call 1-800-JACOB <laughs> <laughs> news right at campfiretv.com <laughs> Yes, indeed. Great show going on. Thanks for joining us today. Uh, quickly getting to the weather. We are going to be in the 70s, not only Saturday, but Sunday as well, thanks to that Canadian high pressure. So we've had enough of this humidity, so now it's time to get a little bit of a break and some nice weekend weather for a change. Definitely a nice break, I think. Yeah. And so do ladies like Canadian high pressure systems? Should I write that one down as well? Uh, well, you have to ask Henry about that. Coming up. <laughs> All right, Jacob, you're going to be back to guest host again in a couple of weeks so we will see you at that point in the meantime we will see you for first news at five